In case you are about to purchase or lease a parcel of land to farm, there is a checklist of what to consider before finalizing a deal. Potential yield and agronomic factors are crucially important for farmers, but many people don't have access to those attributes of farms. In this video, we show how satellites can reveal what you must know about your future farm. While total acreage is what you find in listings and formal documents, actual tillable acres is the area that you practically can grow crops excluding natural features such as wetlands or flooded ditches or salty soil. The challenge is that some features show up differently in wet and dry year. See this farm in Kansas, United States. What you can see from Google Map hardly reveals the history and real-time status of the farm. That's why we use multiple high-resolution images to discriminate non-harvestable areas. You need to know productivity of different zones of a farm year over year. Not only productivity within the farm, but you also want to know how the farm is productive compared to the other farms in the same area. Not all the farms are the same. And that's why by using historical satellites images, we benchmark performance of farms against that of their neighbors. Next to the soil, availability of water is critical. We help you to know precipitation history, how hot it gets in summers, and what time of year you expect to see the first or last frost. If it's irrigated land and water is sourced from local rivers or ponds, historical satellites images reveal if it had dried up in past. Combination of water availability and prolonged hot weather could cause deficit in soil moisture. The Soil Moisture Active Passive Satellites provide you with a profile of soil moisture history in the area. Any prolonged low soil moisture means that cropland suffered from drought. Know the flood history, and I'm not talking about large flood events that you know from news, but rather small local accumulation of surface water that can destroy crop plants but hardly makes the news. Here is an example of such small flood event in Kazakhstan. We use microwave-based satellites to detect overflow of surface water. As you can see, depending on location and slope, not all farms get equally affected from a local flood. Last but not least, you need to know the elevation map of the farm and region because it affects important agronomic factors such as water overflow and soil erosion and soil moisture pattern and the availability of sunlight or shades for plants or animals in the farm. Farming is a complex business and the more you know, the better you manage. Do not commit yourself to a new farm unless you know the essential information. If you need any help to assess a plot of land, reach us at info at and we'll be happy to help.